hi guys in this video I will show you how to print the uh, uh, primavera file so we will go to file <coughs> uh, this is an important topic because it's a bit tricky to adjust the page setup and all these things so go to print preview and the print, print preview appeared here so now to add the header and footers uh, to this uh, to these pages we will click on the page setup and the page setup appeared here so we want to print it landscape okay the page size we will select a3 size because a3 is suitable uh, for printing uh, just to show the Gantt chart plus table view clearly now we will go to the header in the header there are three sections so in the first section let's say we want to add a logo so we will go to picture resize picture and we will go to browse <coughs> and let's say we want to add this logo to the first section of the header in the middle we will add uh, the project name construction of head office baseline schedule we can move back and forth this uh, text and we can change the size of the text from here but for the time being it is ok for this text now move to the next se section here again we want to add a logo for the company so we will go to let's say we want to add this logo click apply and you will see the header is occupied now now go to the footer and we will make some changes to the footers also go to page setup footers and we don't want this revision box or let's say this revision box will be in the place but we want to remove these writings but we will leave the baseline here and we will update the date let's say today is October 21st baseline and XYZ now in the middle section of the footer we can change the calendar to six days because we have used six days calendar here the data date will appear automatically because uh, we the data date will show the the day on which we have rescheduled this uh, project schedule now we can add more dates also let's say I want to add the finish date of the project
we will scroll down the dates here and, and will look for the finish date of the project yes this is here click add apply and you will see another finish date at the bottom the third section we can make changes also if you want but uh, legend is by default appearing here so we want to see the legend also in the bottom click ok but again if we look at the Gantt chart section we don't see any bars here to show these bars in the print area we will go again to the page setup we will go to options time scale we will uh, select the time scale of the project it was from january to december 2020 January 1st time scale will be started and custom date December 31st will be a finished date apply and you will see all the bars are appeared in this Gantt view area now go to print we want to convert it to PDF first so we will select PDF click OK and we will save the PDF in the appropriate folder construction of head office underscore baseline baseline is, in, is already saved in this folder so we will save it here save Now the project file is converted to PDF. Now you can see the preview of the PDF. So this is now ready to be printed on, uh, on the paper. Thanks for watching this video. See you in the next video.